Be your own bank. Dirty car again. They are working on the streets. Every time I clean it and every time it gets dirty again. You can't even see Blockchain Valley and House of Dao anymore. Portuguese people, I think they are getting sick of not being able to go to the beaches. So they just put away these signs. So, the beach is open again. <laughs> <laughs> bon dia! Good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in this beautiful world. Whenever you're watching this video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel. And for the newcomers, my name is Didi Taihutu. And yes, I am the guy that four years ago sold literally everything he owned. Went all into Bitcoin with his family, started traveling the world. Coming to you guys now, four years later, from Lagos in Portugal. Yes, already three months now, Lagos in Portugal. Because of all the lockdowns all over Europe, we can't move too much, but we are exploring this beautiful country, Portugal, that has a 0% tax on cryptocurrency. So that is why we are staying a little bit longer during this bull run. Ah, it's always beautiful to be in a country where you don't need to pay taxes on your cryptocurrency. In today's video, of course, bombing you with some really cool Bitcoin charts, talking about the blockchain news that I read this morning during my delicious cup of coffee, and yes, of course, about the Bitcoin family, the small one and the huge one, more than 2,500 members on Discord now, that is building a lot of really cool projects to help poor people all over the world. Enjoy today's complete video, guys. BAM! It is kind of windy, hopefully, um, you know, the sound is still okay. I am trying to optimize the sound all the time. Maybe I will need to buy this mic, wireless mic connected to the DJI or something. So the sound is a little bit better than when I don't use any of that stuff. Like I said, we are first going to talk about the Bitcoin part. Let's jump into the TA part. The part where I bomb you with really cool Bitcoin charts and information. It is not going to be a long video as I again on Friday, a busy day, and we are going to visit some friends here on the campsite. So sorry if the video is again short. <laughs> I won't say I'm going to try 12 minutes again because I just can't. Bam! First, let's take a look at this four hour chart. This one, bam, on this four hour chart. Which way can I turn the best for the sunlight? I think this one is the brightest, so I need to walk that side. Um, the four hour chart, yes, you can see we had the double top. First, you can see, oh yeah, we broke out of this, out of this flat pattern that Didi was talking about a couple of weeks ago. And then, yes, you can see, ah, now we created this double top at 38K. So everybody said, 38K, double top, bam, we are going to go down. Uh, we did go down, but we fell down to that support line, that green line that you can see in the chart, come upcoming, the short-term support line. We bounce off that line. So we have three touches on the line, which makes it official the support line. And now we bounce off that line and we are going slowly up again. We are almost again at the 38K. So let's see if we could break the 38K now with this push again, with all the volume coming in because of the 1400 attendees to the Michael Saylor Bitcoin Bootcamp that now slowly starting to buy Bitcoin, which I will talk a little bit more about later in this video. But like you can see, it is very important that we break the 38K resistance before we can go all the way up to 40K, 45K and 50K. Because that should be the goal coming out of that huge flag pattern that we have been building in the last couple of weeks. If we don't do this, yes, we could fall back to this green area of support around 33, 34K and even 30K and after that even to 24K. But I don't expect it because I think that more and more people will start to invest in Bitcoin or diversify a small part of their reserve assets of their company into Bitcoin after attending the beautiful Bitcoin bootcamp given to 1400 CEOs all over the world by MicroStrategy and Michael Saylor. Bam! And please remember, I don't think I need to remember you, but please remember, we only have 21 million Bitcoins, which you can beautiful see on this chart, bam, on this chart created by Charles BTC, a really cool Twitter account, please go follow them. No, I don't know him personally, but I just like his charts. But on this chart, you can see the moment now where we are 
in Bitcoin when it comes to the 21 million Bitcoins that will be around in the year 2140. Now we are in the year 2021, but you can see we are almost at the top of this huge curve that has been creating, which means there won't be created that many Bitcoins anymore in those last 120 years. About, what do we say? Two and a half million or something like this? That will be the amount of new Bitcoins flowing into the market in the next 120 years, declining each halving. Now we get 6.25 Bitcoins for every block we mine, and that will be 3.14 years time, or now three years time, and after that it will be only one Bitcoin per block, and that is how it decreases every four years during the halving, and that is why it takes to the year 2140 before the last Bitcoin will enter the market. Woo, Diddy, you talk a lot. Breathe. My wife always says, breathe. Wim Hof always says, breathe. So I need to breathe. <laughs> but that is what I like on this chart, because like you can see, the supply will not change. It will always be that 21 million. And the supply will only increase a little bit from this moment till the year 2140. The demand, on the other hand, is going to increase tremendously. And why is the demand growing day by day? Because more and more institutional investors understand the power of Bitcoin, because more and more governments are agreeing with the power of Bitcoin being the 21st century of gold, and that, and by that allowing all the power plants in those governments from Iran, Iraq, uh, Pakistan, Venezuela, Turkey, to officially mine Bitcoins, the demand is growing because everybody understands by now what the power of Bitcoin and blockchain is. And we will see in tremendous growth. And yes, we will also see this world reserve currency that we now have as a dollar change. Because the world reserve currency changes like every 100 to 120 years, sometimes even after 80 years. I think the dollar already is now a reserve, world reserve currency for over 100 years. So there will be a moment that the dollar will be replaced at the world reserve currency and that could be replaced by a international peer-to-peer -peer store of value currency called bitcoin or maybe just an international created central bank's digital currency that will be backed up by bitcoin as the 21st century gold so we can go back to a digital gold standard you know that gold standard that they let go like 50 years ago something and after that everything went wrong we should have never left the gold standard but the moment we left that gold standard the economies needed to crash now and then and we need to reset now and then so maybe the governments and the central banks learned from this whole history and they are now thinking let's build this new central bank's digital currency backed up by the gold standard bitcoin and that is why i think the demand is growing and like you can see the supply is not increasing as hard as the demand is doing so that means yeah comment down below what that means if you don't know by now what that means then please watch all my videos again it's over 500 videos i think so and it will take you a lot of hours and then again will bring me a lot of revenue which i again can donate to poor people all over the world thank you for that already bam short video so turning around already and trying to uh, record everything walking that way now hopefully the dji is still performing well nah, that way Maybe it's just a screen that looks dark. I don't know. Let's go on, Diddy. Just keep talking. Let's take a look at the Bam Bam indicator and the TikTok indicator. This one, Bam. Like you can see, we traded with an amount of $350 with a leverage of 10. I had a very busy day. I needed to do a lot of administrational work on the laptop, which I don't like. I want to be on the beach creating content, but sometimes I need to do all that administrative stuff as well. So I had a busy day and during that day, I was trading now and then. Like you can see on this chart, I traded with 350 US dollar with a leverage of 10 on Bybit. Please sign up to Bybit using our referral link because then you can claim that reward of almost $600. I don't know if today that is still possible. I think today is the last day. And after that, it will go back again to the $90 reward, which also is a huge reward for just signing up using our referral link. And yes, 
we then again will share those fees with poor people all over the world. You can also sign up to Dudex, it's a $300 deposit bonus. You can also sign up to Prime XBT, again Prime XBT, really cool for copy trading, really cool for the turbo game, and yes, you get a 50% deposit bonus, so that is also really cool. But on this BAM chart, you can see again, we traded with $350 US dollar and a leverage of 10. We did two shorts and a long, and we converted that 350 US dollar into 770 US dollar. So that is a $420 profit with only three trades. The first trade was a short with a 3.6% profit, leverage of 10, 36% profit. The second trade was also a short, a short with 2.2% profit, leverage of 10, 20, 22% profit. And the third trade was along with 1.8% profit with a leverage of 10, 18% profit, converting 350 US dollar into 770 US dollar just with three simple trades based on the DD bam bam indicator, based on the DD, based on the Bitcoin family TikTok swing trader. Really cool. Tick tock, tick tock. Buy, sell, buy, sell. That's the only thing that you need to do while well, you trade the TikTok indicator or the DD bam bam indicator. TikTok, preferably without leverage. Bam bam, preferably with leverage how easy can it be bam want more information go to tdbam.com or click on one of the links down below this video or visit our family and become part of our family at the discord server maybe even buy some family tokens because they are now already worth i think 40 dollar cents or 41 dollar cents we started with eight dollar cents so yes all the people that started to invest in the family token a couple of months ago, ago already made 500% profits just by hodling family tokens. And yes, maybe we will go even higher when Ethereum goes higher, when I do my best, when I work a little bit harder, and when this family grows bigger and bigger and bigger, maybe we'll grow from a 250,000 market cap all the way to a million dollar market cap. We don't know, but everything is possible in life. Bam! There were all the charts for today. Let's jump into the blockchain slash news part, the part where I talk to you about the news that I read this morning. This part, bam! First, really funny news that I need to read. I was drinking my coffee and almost spit out my coffee because of the funny news, is that this huge escrow person in the United States was sentenced to jail, but now was set free because the jail has an issue with COVID, and because they said like, yeah, you know, somebody gave him $3 million to buy 500 Bitcoins, but then he tried to buy the 500 Bitcoins. And then this guy that was in jail got scammed by the person he wanted to buy the Bitcoins for. So he couldn't deliver the Bitcoins to his client, but he lied about that, why he couldn't deliver the clients. But then now, because he was scammed as well, and because of all the flu situation in the prison, ah, yeah, it just set him free. <laughs> so let's all start to scam people. Take three million there, try to buy it there, not succeed in buying there. Tell them, ah, they stole every day, they stole the three million of me. Probably that person there <laughs> is your auntie or your nephew. He stole the three million. You go into jail, you claim that, ah, but I was robbed. You know, they scammed me. That is why I couldn't give the bitcoins. I'm so sorry. I will never do it again. You will be set free because the prisons are full with COVID and all that stuff. And you will go to your nephew to pick up the three million and live a happy life on Ibiza or Miami because there, you know, it's really beautiful for Bitcoins because if they would go where I find a job at the governmental call office, they would be paid in Bitcoin as well. Oh man, come here to Portugal and drink a Bacardi Coke with me because those Bitcoins, you need to pay 0% tax here in Portugal. And you know, if you want to pay tax on stolen Bitcoins, <laughs> Damn. <laughs> just out the top of my head, it could be an idea how it went. I don't know. I just found it really funny to see that people now are not being punished anymore because they couldn't, you know, pay back three million US dollars <laughs> because there is the flu. Ah, this world is really getting more crazy every day. I love it. The world is getting as crazy as I am in my head. How beautiful is this? I finally feel at home. <laughs> Bam! Some more serious news that I read this morning is that Yarn Finest Yarn Finance, the one that, you know, went up to 40k, this one, um, they had a problem with one of their, I think, cold storage wallets, and I think their die were stolen. 
I think it was an attack of uh, like 11 million dollar on, on one of those wallets of that Yarn Decentral Finance um, protocol. And I think the one that hacked them got away with 2.8 million dollar worth of DAI. Um, congratulations to the hacker. Also for you, please come to Portugal and pay 0% tax on that uh, DAI. Because if you convert it to Bitcoin, you probably don't want to pay taxes. And drink a Bacardi Coke with me. And then I can take some of your millions and give it back to this protocol because you know stealing is not that cool steal from the banks <laughs> this is no financial advice by the way I mean, i'm just a dude walking on the beach but if you steal and steal from the rich and give it to the poor don't steal from those that are trying to decentralize the world and fighting the system that we are trying to revolutionize please think again next time when you're going to steal from these companies that are doing a shitload of work to create applications to decentralize finance that's the only thing I need to say. I know I would never tell somebody to steal, but if you steal, then do it. Yeah, steal from the rich and give it to the poor. Like Robin Hood. Oh no, let's not talk about Robin Hood. <laughs> because they are doing the wrong thing again. Because they are working together now with the Sheriff of Nottingham. Bam! Uh, one more news guys because we're almost back at the car and this is the last thing I want to talk about Micro Sailor Micro Strategy did a Bitcoin bootcamp to 1400 CEOs um, in an online event a lot of these CEOs are already buying Bitcoin because we can see on this chart Bam, that the bitcoins are flowing out of the exchanges and they started flowing bigger and more after these two-day events the bitcoin bootcamp by microstrategy so probably a few of those companies that attended that bitcoin bootcamp are already buying bitcoin at the exchanges and extracting them to cold store wallets and that is why i tweeted a couple of days ago which hardware wallet do you like most is it the ledger is it one of the others please comment down below diddy you should keep your bitcoins on this hardware wallet or this cold storage wallet or this company that keeps the bitcoins very safe for you with a multi-signature sending options and inheritance options and all that stuff let me know down below in the comments so i can think this weekend what i need to do with the shit load of bitcoins that i don't have <laughs> that was everything for today guys hopefully you really enjoyed the video if you did enjoy the video give the video a thumbs up share it with your friends and family subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell and please leave a comment